Hey guys, it's Justine, and guess what? Insta360 just came out with a new camera, and it is called the X4. And this thing is about to blow your mind. And if you guys know, Insta360 has made some of my favorite cameras in the past several years. This is pretty much the perfect camera for anyone who loves making videos or taking photos, whether you're all about that adrenaline rush, like some insane action sports, like my snowboarding here, which is, I wouldn't really say this is like a high speed action, but if you're good at snowboarding, <laughs> you're gonna get some incredible shots. And if you're not into action sports, it's also incredible for sharing cool stuff on social media. The new X4 shoots videos in 8K. The previous one shot 4K, so this is a huge upgrade for the new X4. While I was editing some of this footage, I was like, hold on a second, am I watching a movie? Because the quality and the detail is so incredible. And if you're into slow-mo, you can do that also with some amazing detail. Now, I didn't end up exporting this video that you're watching in 8K, but being able to take that high quality 8K content and drop it into a 4K timeline makes it even more crispy. With all of that extra resolution shooting in 8K, reframed videos from the X4 looks amazing. The slow-mo specs are also pretty awesome. You can shoot 60 frames per second at 5.7K, 100 frames per second at 4K, and 120 frames per second when shooting in me mode. Now, me mode is a really cool feature that makes it so easy to get those third-person views. It records a wide-angle, flat video using the invisible selfie stick, so basically it turns the X4 into a normal point-and-shoot style camera, but there's no need to reframe any of the footage. So when you put this into the single lens mode, there's video, there's me mode, you can do loop recording, free frame video, and you can take photos. So for this example, I'm gonna show you guys me mode. It'll keep me in frame, remove the selfie stick. There really is no editing. It automatically does everything for you. Me mode, here it is. Look at me walking. I got a really cool me mode shot while I was in Hawaii as well. I'll show you that right here. Keeping it stable. Super cool. Something I haven't got to try out yet is the super slow-mo in the me mode. 2.7K, 120 frames a second. How's the hair flip? <laughs> also, this is so cool because you can record 5.7K bullet time shots. These are those matrix style shots that are always really fun, but now with that higher resolution, they look better than ever. I wish I could say that you're gonna look better than ever filming them, but now you still look super strange and weird <laughs> swinging a camera with a stick around your head. This right here is the bullet time handle. Look at me! And obviously two of the best features of the X4 are the super smooth flow state stabilization and 360 degree horizon lock. So you don't ever have to worry about shaky or crooked videos, no matter which mode you're shooting in. It's seriously like having your own professional cameraman follow you around. So right now I'm filming in single lens mode. So it's using this rear facing lens and I'm filming the landscape. This is cool because I can use both lenses. So I'm gonna stop recording and then I'm gonna flip it. So it'll now be on the front and now it's recording me. It's also awesome because this will keep it super steady and smooth as well. Flow state stabilization, oh, you're perfect. Now outside of video, if you wanna take some great photos, the X4 can also do that using the 72 megapixel pure shot photo mode. This captures super high quality photos with reduced noise and better color than ever. I don't even think to take photos, but since this does have this new 72 megapixel photo mode, I was like, of course, we're gonna to have to test it out. And when it comes to time lapses, the X4 has some amazing options for that as well. I love doing these so much because you basically can just put the X4 somewhere stationary and it'll record an 11K 360 60 degree time lapse. I think my favorite part about this camera is that you can just start shooting and then you can decide later how you want things to look. So it lets you enjoy the moment and not worry about having to get the perfect shots. With the X4, you can shoot a 360 degree video and pick the best shots later. And with the invisible selfie stick feature, it makes it actually look like someone is filming you. This has always been one of my most favorite features in the Insta360 because a lot of times I end up being a solo content creator. If I'm traveling or out and about, like I know that I can just use this and I can worry about 
reframing shots later and it just does everything that I need. For all of these underwater shots, I did use the underwater dive housing that is made specifically for this so you'll be able to take it into deeper depths. I've loved using this underwater because I don't have to worry about what I'm pointing at. Everything is in the frame. It's 360. The mobile editing app is also better than ever. You can use quick edit tools to easily reframe your footage or you can let the AI edit tool do all of the work for you. Plus, it has a pro mode where you can really get detailed with manual keyframing and Shot Lab where you can choose from a collection of preset video effects. I love having all of these options for editing, especially on the go, because most of the time when I'm out and about, I usually don't have my computer with me, but I do always have my phone. So you can easily connect this to your mobile device and start editing and exporting right away. Now the gesture control on this is pretty awesome because obviously I'm on a super long selfie stick and normally you'd have to go like this, hit record. So when I put my palm up, it automatically starts recording. So right now you can see I'm recording 8K, 360 degree video. And when I put my palm up again, it stops. Now if I wanna take a photo, peace sign, it's doing my countdown. And there you have it. I really love this for when I have the extended selfie stick. Wait until you take out this massive selfie stick and walk around and people start asking questions and it's a whole thing. It just keeps going. Oh man. One of the most important changes with the X4 is definitely this new rugged design. This camera is built to handle whatever you throw at it. It's waterproof, it's built strong, and it now has the option of these ratch resistant lens guards to keep the camera safe. The X4 now comes with a larger two and a half inch Gorilla Glass touchscreen. It uses USB-C 3.0. It has increased Wi-Fi speeds, and this is very important, it has a massive 2,090 milliamp hour battery. This will get you 135 minutes of recording time, which is 67% more than the X3. That's incredible. So whether you're into making epic travel vlogs, capturing your latest snowboarding trick or attempt to doing a trick, or you just wanna make some fun, creative videos, the X4 could be one of the best options for you. I've been such a huge fan of these Insta360 cameras for years, and each time they release a new one, they just keep getting better and better. A huge thank you to Insta360 for partnering with me on this video. I am so excited about this new camera, and if you wanna get more information about it, I'll be putting a link in the description. And if you use my link to purchase, you will also get a free invisible selfie stick with your X4. And of course, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.